Elks sweep the Drifters here tonight by a final score of 9-3. Thanks to the brotherly love here in Bend and Brian Harbour and Andrew Harbour, each of the Bulls of the game tonight. Combined for five scoreless frames between the two of you, how is it to just for you come in first and then you to come right in right behind him? Yeah, it's just it's so awesome being out here in Bend. This place is awesome. Team's awesome. Got great, great guys all around me like Blake right here. Just wanted to go out and have some fun today, do my thing. So, yeah. Brian coming behind Big Bro. Uh, how is that uh, following him up? Yeah, definitely. Uh, this guy obviously threw three shutties, but um, obviously I got to back that up. So that's what it's about. Well, you got the three Ks too, so you came in nicely with a couple of scoreless frames combined for five. How often, because I know you guys played a little bit together in high school too, has one of you come in and the other come right behind him? Honestly, not very much. This was one of the first couple of times it's happened, but we've been playing catch obviously over the years, so we got that connection, so it was only a matter of time before this guy came in and backed me up today. Yeah, I just had to make uh, make sure to show older brother up by uh, getting more Ks than him. So. Yeah. Yeah, you got more innings, you got more Ks, it, it works out. But um, what is it like for just each of you two to, to be reunited here together for this summer before each of you, you go to USD and you go to USC? Yeah, it's pretty sweet coming out here, sharing what we love with baseball and obviously might not be able to have this opportunity again, so just making the most of it. So definitely going to enjoy these next seven, eight weeks. And, yeah, hopefully we get back out here in Bend next summer to repeat this, so. <laughs> well, look forward to each of you having uh, a great summer this year. Off to a great start. Each nice debuts for both of you as the Elks sweep the Drifters here tonight, taking on the Portland Pickles for the first of three tomorrow night at 635.